As of today, families can once again visit loved ones being cared for in nursing homes. It comes following new guidance from the state health department. News Channel Lines Josh Martin, live outside Loretto for us with what you need to know before you go and visit your loved one. Josh. Christy, for so many people, it's been months since they've been able to see their loved ones in person. Today, less stringent guidelines being rolled out by New York State. The state will be dropping the 28 days of corona-free mandate that it's been working under for the past few weeks. That's going to be cut in half. It now goes to 14 days, a facility 14 days COVID-free. They will also require visitors to show that they have a negative test within the last seven days. So in order to see someone, you have to go get a COVID-19 test. The new guidance will allow visitation to around 80% of nursing homes across the state. The number of visitors must not exceed 10% of the amount of people at a facility and only two visitors per resident at one time. Now, places like Loretto behind me are getting ready to adjust to this new guidance. We're on track here at our main facility for September 28th, and we're actually already booking appointments at the Commons in Auburn and our Nottingham nursing home facility. So we've been ready for this for a while. We're pretty excited that this has been relaxed a little bit for us and our families. Several nursing homes opting to do online booking for visiting at their facilities. Make sure you call ahead to your facility to see what their program is so you can go see your loved one once the guidelines are in place at those certain facilities. Live in Syracuse, Josh Martin, News Channel 9.